for us. You know, we may give up some points in this game, so offense has to be ready each and every time to either equal or try and get us ahead and try and keep us ahead. This is their chance to respond to that first touchdown given up. Well, partner, I'm not sure how this drive's going to end, but how about the way they flip field position there? A nice attacking play. They picked up a heck of a chunk of yardage. So how about that for a chain mover? They're all the way down inside the 40 now for first and 10. And he is going to be stopped cold behind the line of scrimmage. Officially, it's a one-yard loss. That's going to bring up second and 11. After one, seven nothing on EA Sports. Thirty-eight yard line, second and eleven. Mahomes now to throw. Flush to his right. This one complete to Nicole Hardman. Fired that one in there, able to make connection on a nice in route. With those faster passes when they're going that fast, any hesitation as a quarterback that the deflection, if you miss, might be bigger and lead to an interception? Yeah, and the deflection works both ways. Maybe a defender gets a hand in the way and it pops in the air. And sometimes you throw it so hard your receiver can't handle it, and he pops it up in the air for the defenders to grab as well. But a moot point there is they were able to connect. A handoff now for Pacheco. And he can only manage to get a couple. Second and eight coming up. Well, they certainly had success throwing the ball on this drive and not as much running it as we just saw once again on that last play. Stopped after a very short gain. But I wouldn't abandon the run totally because otherwise, pass rushers just tee off on your quarterback. Makes it very, very difficult for him in that situation. Now Patrick going to change the play. Now Mahomes throwing on second down. He'll check this one down to Pacheco. And he'll go out of bounds in the red zone just inside the 20. It'll go down as a gain of six. And now we've got a third and three. They'll try for the first with Pacheco. And they'll bring him down at the 13-yard line. It's a pickup of six. Plenty of things to talk about here, partner, but to me, their defense gave up a touchdown on the first drive. How about how they're responding, coming back? That's a big third down pickup to keep their drive alive. Throwing on first down is Mahomes, eluding the pressure right. He'll wind up getting right about four there on the scramble, and it's second down. To throw, it's Mahomes. This is caught. And in for the Chiefs touchdown. Mahomes hitting his favorite target, Travis Kelsey, on the touchdown pass. And the Chiefs are within an extra point of tying up this ball game. Extra point by Butker is on target. And we are tied at seven. Each team's had it. Each team has scored. 7-7 seven, seven here as the kick's away. And they will not get a chance to return this one as it's through the end zone for a touchback. On first and 10, it's Wilson. Screenplay set up for Williams. And he gets this one just shy of the 40. They'll mark him down at the 39. First down now, but that clock rolling. Here's Wilson to throw. Look at the big fella go. He's got room at the 30. Down the right sideline. And all the way home for a Bronco score. Russell Wilson with two first-half touchdown passes. And the Broncos have taken the lead.
Lutz will look to add the extra point. And he's got it. It's now a 14-7 ball game. After the touchdown, Lutz to kick it off. And this will not be returnable. It's out of the back of the end zone for a touchback. The Chiefs offense about set to begin this drive. And Charles, we'll see what they can do here. Not a ton of time left, but enough certainly to get points out of this drive. And they need them right now because they're trailing. Yeah, this is exactly why you practice a two-minute drill all through camp and at least one practice each week before a game. A minute left, more than enough time to string a few completions together, reach the end zone, and then make that walk back to the locker room just a little more animated. Mahomes throw taken in by Valdez Scantling. And from the 25, they work this to the 29, a gain of four. Now they'll change things up. Throwing is Mahomes on third. Able to find the open man. That's complete. The Chiefs now going to use the first of their timeouts as they get the stoppage with just under 50 seconds remaining in half number one. Again, they'll throw with Mahomes. A dump down to McKenna. And he gets it down a yard or two shy of the 30 before he's out of bounds. They get 10 more there, and I believe that'll be enough for another first yellow, down at will. Mahomes going to throw. Open man. It's the tight end, Kelsey. Now another timeout called for by the offense as they stop it here with just under 40 ticks to go in this first half. Now a first and 10 at the 11. From the gun, it's Mahomes. And that is caught. Touchdown, Kansas City. Nicole Hardman, an 11-yard touchdown. And the Chiefs are an extra point away from tying the ball game here in the final minute of the first half. Extra point by Butker is on target. And that is going to tie our game as we approach halftime. This one tied at 14 now as he sends this one away. And this will be a touchback as that sails over the end line. Denver offense at the line ready to go. And they'll have a little bit of time to work with. 35 seconds until the break. And he will find his man Sutton. That's complete. And he's going to be out up around the 45-yard line. An ideal beginning of the drive there as they'll get 20 and a first down. Wilson. Open man, and again it's Sutton. Now the Broncos are going to call the first of their timeouts as they'll stop the clock with 26 seconds to go until halftime. Back-to-back -back good plays have them on the move on first down. Here's Wilson. Open man downfield is Judy. He's got it. And he'll go out of bounds inside the 15-yard line. Two chunk plays in a row. The last one was over 20 yards, and so is this one. From the 13 now, they work on first and 10. Here's Wilson. To the goal line, but it's incomplete. The throwing windows get a lot tighter near the end zone, don't they? And here's the thing. You already probably have three points in your hip pocket. You force a throw here and give up an interception, you come away with nothing. Especially tough in the middle third of the field where he threw that one. Right. 
Now a second and ten. Now it's Wilson. And he comes back with one complete. And the Broncos are looking at first and goal as he's tackled all the way down at the two-yard line. Now the Broncos going to use the second of their timeouts as they stop it with 11 seconds remaining in this first half. Williams is into the end zone for a Bronco touchdown. Well, they move the ball down the field through the air, Charles, and then finally they get the running game involved, and it works to perfection. Touchdown. And, partner, I kept waiting for that running game to come into play and actually saved it until the very end. Touchdown goes on the stat sheet, but you and I both know, and he knows as well. His teammates airing it out made this a successful drive. So not much time to work with here. Nine seconds remain in the half as this one is away. And that'll carry over the back line of the end zone for a touchback. The KC offense out of the huddle, ready for their next drive. And with only nine seconds remaining, well, not much time, we'll see how they play this. And he'll be out of bounds across the 30-yard line. They'll come up now second and four from the 31. Final shot before the half from Mahomes. Caught Kelsey, left side. And Kelsey's going to have a Chiefs first down as he'll get this up to the 39. So two quarters down, two remain. Charles and I return after the break. And we welcome you back now. Alongside Charles Davis, I'm Brandon Gunn, getting set for quarter number three here. It'll be the Chiefs football to begin quarter number three, and they trail here as we are back underway now on EA Sports. And they will not get a chance to return this one as it's through the end zone for a touchback. The Chiefs offense about set to begin this drive. Well, Charles, in that first half, we saw a fair amount of offense on both sides of the football, and now the team trailing here will start with it in the third quarter. And we both know this coach pretty darn well, don't we? Because his game planning is always on point. And now that he's getting the ball to start the second half, how about all the offense that you already referenced in the first half? He'll put that all together and come out with something really strong, I believe, to get things going here in the third quarter. Pacheco gets it again on second down. And he'll be upended at the 33 following a gain of three. And guess what? It brings up third down. I have to think a major focus of the halftime means had to be figuring out how to create space for the running game to get operating. Well, what you pointed out to me at half seems accurate. That line has struggled to sustain blocks. Yeah, I would agree with that totally. They've got to focus on staying on their double teams at the first level, make sure that block's secured before they slide off and try and chip someone at the second level. His fifth catch tonight, and it's good for a first down. And that one was a lot of fun right there because that was the game within the game. Third and short, blitz was on. What's the key for the quarterback? Get out of your hands in a hurry. And that was a quick little completion. Got the job done for a first down. Mahomes. Well, this one complete. It's Rasheed Rice. And he's going to be out of bounds, but not before he takes it inside the 40. That'll wind up a gain of 27 on the catch and run. So a first and 10 now in Denver territory at the 36. They go play fake. Mahomes. A pass complete downfield. It's Valdez Scantling. And he doesn't quite make it, taking it within an eyelash. Dropped at the one. It's a gain of 35. Two big plays in succession. Not sure this D knows what hit them, but now they got to get ready. It's first and goal. Mahomes to throw once more. And that is caught for the touchdown, Kansas City. Jarek McKinnon, a one-yard touchdown reception. And the Chiefs are an extra point away from drawing level. Butker on for the PAT. PAT. 
He's got it, and we're all tied at 21. Nothing separating these two teams on the scoreboard as the kick's away here. And he'll elect not to run with it. And a fair catch will move this out to the 25-yard line. The Broncos onto the field, ready to start their next drive. Their halftime lead now evaporated. We're back to level following that touchdown a moment ago. And that shouldn't change the mindset a whole lot from an offensive perspective because they already knew this was going to be a hard-fought game. Now they just need to go out, execute their game plan, and keep moving. 52 yards now on the ground on just seven carries. Took just one play to move all the way to the 44 as they try again on first down. Now Wilson. Oh, he rifles one, and that's going to be intercepted. And they are going to set up shop at the 40-yard line. So after the INT, here's Mahomes. And this time not quite to the 30. It'll be down at the 31-yard line. And that's good for a pickup of 10 yards. And that'll leave him with a second and just a few inches left. Here's Mahomes to throw. Catch is made by Hardman. And he's taken down, but not before reaching the 10-yard line. And a nice gain of 21 yards. Yellow, Under yellow. a minute to go in this third quarter as they come up first and 10. Yellow, yellow. They'll run here with Pacheco. And the reinforcements come in as they're going to stop him behind the line. It's a loss of a yard there, and now second down. If you're the coaching staff upstairs, you might want to file that play away. Do you see how fast the safety closed on that one? Coming up in run support, made a big-time tackle. Might want to try and check into a pass next time. Yeah, got him for a loss. Really, really great play defensively. 43! 43! Once more, it's Pacheco. And he's going to be brought down just shy of the five at the six. It'll be a gain of five on the play, and it'll also be the final play of this. Now Mahomes. And this is going to be intercepted. Picked off by Justin Simmons. And they will finally stop him, but a great return. Gets that football all the way down to the 16-yard line. So the ball down to the 16 here for first and 10. Let's go, let's go double count right here, double count. After the interception, here's Wilson. Touchdown! Making a hat trick for Russell Wilson. Three touchdown passes now. And the Broncos have broken this deadlock and have taken the lead here in the fourth. Lutz good on the extra point, and they will take a seven-point lead. After the touchdown, Lutz to kick it off. And this will not be returnable. It's out of the back of the end zone for a touchback. The KC offense out of the huddle, ready for their next drive. And now, after the touchdown a moment ago, they work from behind in a seven-point game in this fourth quarter. 
Plenty of time on the clock. They'll start the drive here with Pacheco. And he's got some space here. And that's going to be a Chiefs first down as the tackle made here at the 36. Most of their damage has been done through the air. I mean, they've rung the bell three times with passing touchdowns. But guess what? Ground game has not been neglected. Nice little burst right there. Mahomes now on first down. That ball is caught. Marquez Valdez scambling. And he'll be out just a yard or two shy of the 30. They'll get 34 yards there. On play action, it's Mahomes. And this one too low. Well, they've been back on the heels a little bit here on this drive, but a chance to exhale just a little bit there with incompletion on first down. Now they have to gear up, try and get two more stops, and escape this drive. Pacheco gets it up the gut. Five yards, now it's third and five. It's not a huge breakaway run, but if your starting running back finishes the game with averages of five or six yards per touch, you'll take that every single time. One of the bigger plays in the game thus far, and the crowd getting into it as we come up on a big third down. Mahomes now to throw. Open man right side is Rice. And he will have a Chiefs first down. He needed five. He got it barely as it will officially go down as a gain of five yards. On first and ten, here's Pacheco. And he can only manage to get a couple. Second and eight coming up. And now they're in the hurry up. Mahomes going to change things up. On second down, here's Mahomes sliding out of the pocket. And he just chucked that one out of bounds, out of everyone's reach. Maybe a wise call not to take a sack in this part of the field. It brings up third down. The Chiefs on third down. They have been superb. Five for six to this point. This is third and eight. A dump down to McKinnon. And he's going to come up well short as they rally up to stop him at about the 16. Where will the pressure come from? Fourth and six now. And in for the Chiefs touchdown. Patrick Mahomes fighting me, Cole Hardman. And the Chiefs are an extra point away from tying this game here in the final minutes. Don't forget the extra point. It's up and good. And, partner, we've got a tie game here in the fourth. Now, this one setting up for a great finish. All tied in the fourth as the kick's away. And he'll elect not to run with it. And a fair catch on the kickoff will move the ball to the 25. Here's first down. They begin the drive with Williams. And he is met in his tracks behind the line of scrimmage. Sometimes I think these defensive tackles get a little bit of a bum rap. We just see them as big guys that eat up blockers for others to make tackles. Oftentimes they're quicker than they get credit for. And this time he uses quickness to make a play. Getting down to the good stuff. All tied with two minutes remaining on EA Sports. They'll come up now. This is second and long. Out of the gun. Here's Wilson. Oh, look at this. It's intercepted. Picked off by Legereus Sneed. And he brings it back to right around the 26-yard line. Well, this had trouble written all over from the start. He's got two extra defensive backs in the game he's got to deal with. They're in a dime set. So everywhere he's looking, he's seeing a different color jersey. And sure enough, this one winds up being intercepted. Well, it looks like they'll move things around here. Hey, 
On the handoff, it's Pacheco. And he's going to take this ahead for right around three yards, but no more than that. Second down. Not a big run on the first play of the drive, but that doesn't necessarily mean it was a bad play. Sometimes you're just trying to settle in, get your guys a little bit of contact, and get things moving. Here's a second and seven. Mahomes. He'll check this one down to Pacheco. And able to get him down, but he does reach the five. Nothing open downfield. They went underneath. Yeah, see if you can get it to your running back. See if he can make someone miss in the open field. Here we go, first and goal. And it's straight, it's Pacheco. And he is going to be stopped cold behind the line of scrimmage. Now the Broncos are going to call the first of their timeouts as they get it with 26 seconds to go in the football game. Now from the seven, here's second and goal. Hey, and Mahomes sees something, he'll change the play. Here's Pacheco once again, and he's brought down right at the five-yard line. Give him two on the play. Now the Broncos going to use the second of their timeouts. That'll leave them with just one remaining in this fourth quarter of play. This crowd doing all they can. Here's third and goal. They'll try and run with Pacheco. And this is going to result in losing yardage. They're driven back to the eight-yard line. And I don't think there should be much of a discussion here, but you know how I am. You kick the football, you take the lead. How bold do you want to be in this situation, though? So here we go. Maybe the biggest kick of the game forthcoming. This to almost certainly win the football game. Butker's kick here is good. And the sideline celebrates as they have taken the lead in the final minute. So he's able to come through in a hostile environment, and you'd have to imagine that's the game winner. Yeah, how about that? And the way that this game's gone, you think they really wanted to get to overtime and take their chances there? They wanted to get this thing done. When you're the visitor, you don't want to play into overtime. You want to knock it down, get it done, and go home. Here's first and ten. Throwing now is Wilson. Finding Sutton. And he'll have a quick first down here as he gets out of bounds to stop the clock. And he did exactly what they needed him to do, Charles. Got out of bounds. They have no timeouts. And they knew that before the play even began. Still executed it. How many times have we seen it happen where you know it? Get a guy still looking for a timeout or trying to stay in bounds. He got it done. And he will find his man Sutton. That's complete. That was a long shot, but they did get one final chance to try to score and overcome this small deficit. No touchdown, though, Charles. 